Hello, welcome to the reading room, Sylvie. Um, we're going to do a tarot reading on their thoughts, feelings, the future outcome when it comes to you. Group one, two, three, four, and five. Go with the one you feel, your first choice, usually the right one. <laughs> Sometimes you have two messages from two different piles, that's okay. Or two different persons you want to know about, then you can choose two piles, you know. So group one, let's see what you have. Now this could be a friend, a lover, a boyfriend, girlfriend, um, best friends, family, you know. Well, you see who you want. But anyway, it's uh, their thoughts, fe their thoughts, feelings, and the future outcome for you okay when it comes to you I should say so uh, the universe is open so things are wide open in this relationship this is a good sign uh, things are doing good and they're open to all kinds of possibilities so I got a I have a feeling that it's like a friend that could be a potential future <laughs> with them you know it could turn into something even greater and if it's not that and it's and it's closeness in the families or closeness in in best friends that too it is going to be even better that's what i get so what are their thoughts on this their thoughts well they're thinking they are thinking they're planning and thinking and they, and they don't stop um hmm that's crazy um they they're thinking and planning and also um they have uh, the thoughts of running away, <laughs> the thoughts of leaving, the thoughts of going, that's what they think. The universe is open for them in a way that we're not thinking. I wasn't, wasn't getting that message at the very beginning. For them, the message is that the, the world is wide open and they should uh, be thinking about themselves and, and they should be thinking about what they want, not what you want. And they should be planning, um, or they should be planning their lives with you, and or they should be just leaving everything behind and going. They're really weighing that down. So, so um, they're at a crossroad, I would say. And their and their thoughts on you is that um, do I do I pursue this or do I run away? That's you know like go do something else. It shouldn't be running away, but for some it is running away. For others, it could be just a choice. You know, do I settle down with this person, or do I, or do I move on and and do something else? And it's all self-based for them. They're weighing it. What's the best for them? What is the outcome? What are they getting out of this? It's very uh, selfish-based um, decision. Which we should all do that. Actually, we should all kind of like sit back and think what's good for us. You know, when it comes to making a decision. Um, Yeah, the the road ahead is kind of far for them, but they do see something wonderful. They feel like they feel like you could be you could be worth the the try. You could be worth the trip, and this could be worth doing. And and this definitely uh, could succeed. And they could see themselves with you and having a family. And or or and if it's not a loved one to have a family with, they could see uh, you in their family. If you're someone that's joining the family. Or they could they can see uh, being around you a lot more, uh, being around the family a lot more. It just depends. I I really don't pick a best friend type scenario here, so I'm not sure um, how that fits in. Um, but it's definitely um, a closeness. You know, definitely this is someone's thinking about how close things could be and how it could turn out, and um, you know they could see this happening. So. Their feelings is leaning um, towards you, but they still have that piece of them that they're wondering if they should just never mind. For you, well, for you, it's not a problem. There's no problem. There's no, uh, <clears throat> not, they're not worrying about anything. You're kind of like just wait, you're, you're, you're ready and, and waiting for them to do, like, to, to let you know, like, like, is it is it a go or not so you're kind of like on standby but you don't mind like this is uh, something that you you are kind of wondering about and uh, you're willing to see where it goes and if it goes then you're willing to go with it so you're kind of like um on the fence of just waiting 
because they they didn't decide. So this um, this uh, um, question and on who you're asking, um, you know, it's not. Um, it's just kind of you're just kind of hanging out, waiting, kind of thing, and they're debating. So it's all on their side, pretty much. Um, but it does look like it, it does look uh, positive. It looks like um, they just don't know what to do or how to go about it, and they and it looks positive because they're going to try. They're they're going to try uh, to do this. They they're gonna to try to make it work. They they are. They're just not sure. They're not very good at this. They don't know how to go about it, or they don't know if they can succeed. But they're going to give their whole effort into this. So they're they're in like they're going to give themselves a hundred percent. They're they're going to commit and 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 give this a good try. They're honest. They're being honest. They are an honest person, and they're uh, but. Um, They've been true to the, true to their path, true to themselves. Um, they keep their honesty kind of tucked away, you know. They don't all share all their their thinking and opinions and and what they're up to uh, with you, or with anyone else actually. But um, yeah, they're they're going to try it. But they do have that that the thought of running away or never mind or was well, this is this good for me so they do have that in the back of their mind although they plan to to give it a good try before they they come to their conclusion or their their thinking so that's pretty much it hmm. doesn't sound bad at all so you know what? I'm not even going to uh, pull another card. I don't feel like this reading needs more cards, and I'm going to pull out uh, one from the 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 your spiritual guide, your guidance, your 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 divine. A message for you is uh, one uh, on this subject or something else. Let me see. Oh, enlightenment. Hmm. This is enlightenment. So you, it's it shows that uh, this is going to be very good. This is very, uh, very good. Um, you'll learn a lot. You'll get through a lot. You'll understand things that you didn't before. You'll understand more. Um, it's like there's caution flags all around you, and you're like uh, asking uh, to be guided and asking to uh, to be um, protected. And they're they're definitely definitely giving you this, so you're definitely going to be protected. Don't you worry, and um, you're going to be guided, and um, uh, yeah, you can proceed. Just and, and and the caution, well, it's up there. I mean, you don't have to have it too tight, but you can be cautious. It's okay, you know. Take your time. All right, that's what I'm getting. So, hope that uh, helped. Okay, group uh, two. Let's see what's going on with you. Well, the 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 thing, the question is um, their thoughts, feelings, the future outcome when it comes to you. Well, so far things are not known, or they're they're unknown, or it's an adventure. Either way, either like you have to head, it's headed in a way that we don't not sure about, or it's um, don't know how it's going to turn out. Uh, it's it's kind of like. Um, an adventure of some kind, but don't know if it's good or bad yet. So, what are they? What are they thoughts? What are their thoughts? Well, they're they're quite uh, depressed. They're quite depressed, and they rush into things without thinking. They just they when they want something, they go ahead, and um, but they're very happy. So they show that they're happy. They show that they enjoy life. They show that they're they're very. Uh, out there, but that's but in reality, uh, they rush into things at, to hide the fact that they're depressed. They're not. They're not doing well. They they're very negative, and they they they're very um, down. And um, their their true self isn't healthy, even though they they bring out the best and they show the best. But uh, they have this side to them that's uh, that's um, kind of dark. So when they think about you. When when they have thoughts about you, 
They they think that you're going to be a lot of fun. They think that they, they can enjoy you to the fullest. And yet, at the same time, they... they, they they get very down about you. Like they, they're like, Hmm, I don't know. Like they get depressed, whether it's too much effort, whether it's too work, they're very depressed. So, um, their thoughts is, is, is very depressing. Um, it's kind of like contrary. Like it's, it's either, it's not really, um, it's like they one minute they're good and then they're not kind of thing. And, and, um, but they rush into it. They, they rush, their, their thought is uh, rush towards you or rush and, and make sure they do things with you. Uh, they feel very rushed um, or they have to show that they're they're ready to jump and date everything. And so when it comes to thinking about you, it's, it's that kind of thoughts they're having. But it, I really feel like they're not so concentrate on thinking about you as much as they they really want to show you good time even if they they don't feel like it they want a new start a new beginning a new way of being and they believe that with you they'll be successful and that's their feelings so that's why they hide that they feel depressed that's why they hide that they they just rushing into this is because they they're rushing their the it's because they feeling like this could be a good, something good, and they, they have hope. Well, there's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong. It's all good. No, no headaches. You don't have to, like, worry or anything, is after you're wondering, because it seems like everything is a go. It's all like, yes, go ahead, do it. Um, it seems to be fine. It seems like everything is great. So even though they're having some depression or, or you, maybe you're picking up on that depression or they're sending you depressing thoughts or they're not talking to you in a good way. And they, and when they rush, they, their depression is showing through, not sure how that's, uh, how you're perceiving them. Um, but they're trying to show how happy they are. Um, and they're trying, they're, they Maybe they are letting you know they're very depressed, but, um, and that's the hope, but it seems like for you, everything is fine. Yeah. They're just, they're just waiting for their opportunity and they're ready to go wherever it takes them. And they're, they're ready to do the work and put in the time and, uh, have things done and work hard and get it all and, and make sure that they accomplish it and, and create it. So for them, um, they're not in a good point in their lives and they think about you and sometimes they have negative thoughts about you or they think that you're you're up to something or you're rushing and doing things that you shouldn't be doing. I don't know what their thoughts are. It's pretty, pretty uh, scattered. So I'm getting a lot of scenarios. Maybe I'm picking up because a, a this is general general reading. So I'm, maybe I'm picking up a lot of different people and they're like so I'm getting receiving a lot of messages but it's still um it don't matter what messages I'm picking up kind of because the basic the the basic idea or the basic thought or what's coming out is that they're trying to to put out their best foot and they're trying to be happy and yes they're depressed yes they rush into things but um it's the it's because they feel that this is a good opportunity it's because it's a good start and things will be so beautiful and wonderful and that's why they're rushing in and and so if you feel rushed then that's the reason but there's nothing bad or nothing you should be worrying about all that stuff is 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 a go it's um actually going to to uh that's what they were waiting for, someone like you, and it's going to turn out. They're going to turn themselves around. They're going to go for it. They're going to work, pick up their, their stuff and, and, and put themselves on track again. Where it takes you, it's really not sure. Um, how long this relationship is, it's not sure either. Like this person that's that you're talking about or asking about, there's no set... Um, they haven't been at the crossroads yet. There might be some more learnings. How... how um, how far this goes, it doesn't say. I'm picking a card from your spiritual guide, your spirits. Let's see what's going on with them. What they have to say. Protection. 
So if you need to protect this, then go ahead. If you need to protect yourself, then go ahead. But definitely protection is, is something that you have to think about. So um, protect protect your interests, protect uh, yourself in, in whatever way you feel you need to. So if it's not investing in it too much, then don't. Um, if it's uh, invest, you know, like whatever you, you're feeling. I'm going to pull another card. Actually, I'm not going to pull a card from this one. I, I feel like I, I need to pull more from this one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to ask a question of, from the, the moon. I'm going to ask that uh, to be clarified, to give us a little bit more on the moon, on the, on the path of where we're going and what we're headed. Oh, it's it's actually good. It's <laughs> it's a good journey. Nothing to worry about. Actually, it's going to be it's going to on the other side. It's going to be so good. It's just uh, it's going to be a journey that you take that you're not sure of, or you're not sure where you're headed or where you're going. It's not written. It's not you haven't chosen. Uh, so that's wide open. So um, when you two get together. There must be some decision to be made because they're waiting for an opportunity. They're ready to go anywhere and at any time. Um, so, and they're re ready to put in the work. So, um, yeah. Seems good. So what are you protecting yourself from? I, I'm going to pull out a card. Spiritual guide is giving you a message. Oh my goodness, look at that, an angel. <laughs> you know, you're protecting, you have to protect your interests, what you want, what you want to create. So it's not all about them. You have to think about yourself and protect what you want too. Well, isn't that beautiful? So don't let them overtake you, like take, like, and, 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 and consume it and be all about them. You, ha you can't forget about yourself. You have to protect who you are and your interests. And you and what you want to go in and forward in. So, uh, yeah, that's kind of beautiful. I'm glad I pulled those cards for you. All right, so I want to leave it at that. Okay, group number three. Let's see what's happening with you. So, uh, this is your thoughts, your feelings on the future, the outcome. I read that wrong, but anyway, it's, it's, <laughs> it's the future outcome when it comes to you, okay? So, um, yeah, it seems to be uh, some efforts being put in, some teamwork. Yeah, it seems like, um, um, yeah, I get that there's quite a bit of, um, bit of steps or, or, or activity going on and and let's find out some more so what are, what are they thinking about you what like what's their thoughts their th oh their thoughts is uh that they want to um they want to choose they they have things that they need to choose so they're thinking about you they feel really like this is you're you're good for them or you're good you, they like the being around you or they enjoy you or they enjoy your surroundings your friends your family uh, it seems like there's a whole package that uh, seems to be awesome and, and feel like celebrating it. So it it seems like um, things are good. There's a decision that needs to be made and it seems like it's quite profitable. So th um, they're seeing that uh, with you, they could, they could uh, profit, they could gain, they could... Uh, there's something about you that could be like really good. Um, they see the potential in it. They see that they can they can actually get some benefits. They they could step all over you too. Uh, you might bite or you might uh, make a few a few sounds, but they they look like they can. Uh, hmm. Yeah, something about you that that interests them. How do they feel about you? Well, you're a bit stressful, and and uh, but you have a big heart, or you're full of goodness, um, and and you do a lot. So they feel like you're 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 very uh, uh, active, or you're very good. You 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 nourish a lot of uh, of your surroundings and and people around you. And um, I feel that they they feel you're a little stressful because you do a lot. And you're constantly doing, and there's, and you always have good heart.
Yeah, it seems a little like they, like um, they they see the benefits in you. What about you? Like, well, this is not all that great for like you don't. Well, you don't even put much thought in whether it's good or not for you. You're not really uh, even uh, considering like thinking about it or whether it's a good thing or not or whether you should trust this person or whether you know like you're not putting that in there and uh, you're just like uh, thinking um, oh this is great but you're not putting any thought in it what is it is it great like you know yeah there's a question mark here being asked you know on your end because it seems like uh, yeah they see a lot of good but they also see a lot of benefits you know and they're willing to put up with some stress for the benefits of it all, you know. And they see that there's lots to choose from. Even, but they do enjoy your company. But they also, there's two. Like, they, they, they see the benefits in it, too, right? Yeah. The two of you together. Together forever. No, they're really, seriously. <laughs> you both are there. Uh, but... The, yeah, they're willing to to do the work too. Ah, I see. So for them, you know, this relationship or what they think or feel about you is is that you're you're uh, you can benefit them, but they're willing to to put in the work too. They're willing to jump in uh, on board. So they see that you're you're um, a person that uh, accomplishes and and uh, you know you have a fulfilled life and. Uh, they're ready to jump on board with that. Like they, they can see you two together making it something really wonderful, something really good. So this might not be romantic. This might be a friend, best friend or family member that sees the potential in you and sees that if they if they follow with you, then, then they may succeed just as much as you or you both will benefit because they're willing to jump in and make it easier for you or, or help you out or, or, or work just as hard. And if it's a love um and to, like person you're you're talking you're asking about love it looks like love isn't enough for them love and um succeeding is important so um yes being in love is one thing but also making a great life and, and owning a lot and doing a lot isn't just as important so they want someone that's accomplished or can be accomplished so and they're willing to put in the work with them and, and accomplish too so two successful persons together makes it a lovely life for them it's not all about love if, if it's this is a love reading they don't they don't see it that way Is this from your spiritual guide? Let's see what they have to say. Oh, yeah, it's fulfilling. Um, it's definitely uh, something that can grow into something beautiful, the passions. You can mix your passion together. You can you can actually do something well worth it. You can dream. You can you can uh, make wishes. You can uh, um, manifest. Your journey can be beautiful. Yeah, it's, it's quite... So if that's what you like what you look at what you're asking and if that's what you're looking for something someone that you can fulfill your life with but also grow and not just in love but in materialistic uh, environment or or travel or or there's there's obtained some goals uh this person uh will definitely help you with that they're on they're they're definitely going to would jump in and, and go for it with you so it's not a bad <laughs> It's just, um, there's more more than just love. Okay. Okay, group number four. Let's see what's, what's happening with you. Their thoughts, feelings, the future outcome. The future outcome. <laughs> the future outcome when it comes to you. <laughs> put the rest in it eh? okay let's see what's going on um well they seem to be uh their intentions is to come and and pick you up and swoop you up they're they're willing and able and wanting so what's going on here what are they thinking about oh they're thinking about you they're thinking about how much they love you or how much they want you in their lives and how they're willing to go and 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 get you and how you you're going to make their lives even better and and it's like a, 
a second chance with you. So if you're a second chance, then it's written right here. It's a second chance. If you're not a second chance, then they're 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 uh, judging the situation, and they see that there's a lot of good, and that they would be very interested in this relationship, and also um just they they want to rush right in, like you know. But they're so this is love relationship. These this person's in love. <laughs> their 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 thoughts is to go get you, and 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 do and go ahead. Yeah, they um how they feel. They feel like they can just throw throw themselves in and go to the like go to the other side. Like they just want to just uh, take the venture. Um, they they just want their heart to show them the way, show them the light. They they're willing to just. Uh, give it all and, and just see where it goes and uh and they're quite content about that and they're quite dreamy and um but they don't all, they don't see exactly uh how good it's going to be like like they're not sure about that their feeling is mm, maybe like maybe they they they're kind of like down or they're kind of looking down like they're they're like looking at all the possibilities that could go wrong instead of looking at the ones that can go right so they want to take the chance and they want to go in and all that stuff but they're not that confident they they, they see all the the negatives what about you well you haven't met and thought much about it and and you really don't see any any issues or you never thought much about what could go wrong or if there's anything that could go wrong you're pretty much like hooked like you want you want this relationship or you you're going to be hooked into this person so for you it's all good and it's a go and and um so if this is not a love relationship then if you're if it's your best friend you just you're just willing to go ahead and do whatever you got to do with them if it's your family your friends whatever it is whoever you're asking it's all good in your side and if but i feel like it's more like love mm, it's definitely very uh very uh well planned or well thought of and they're kind of shy you're kind of shy but um oh my goodness and you're feeling like it's not possible or or they feel like it's not possible or this relationship's not possible hmm why isn't it possible because both of you are shy <laughs> wow interesting I, I i'm pausing because i'm like blown away by the, the ending i'm like what what the freak what are you talking about you know that's that's how i'm feeling right now at this moment i gotta move these out of the way so let's see what's going on here clarify that for me please I need the I need the end the, the last bit there. I need the nine of wands, three of pentacles, and the eight of swords. I need them clarified. I need that clarified. So we have it. So here we go. So first of all, things are not known. They're, for you that's awesome like not knowing where things are going or how it's going to happen and letting letting things go and flow as they should flow that's awesome that's for you that's everything is great calm and and collective and let things happen and um they're shy the the dream or the thoughts is to make it happen even though you both are shy um and, and needing the chance so uh, this is really feeling stuck. It's feeling like that's is stuck, like you you know you it's the wants there, but and 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 wanting to get you, thinking about getting you, and and but just they don't feel confident and able to do it. So um, this may not go anywhere it's because they're not going to move on it. Okay, let me see. Spiritual guide, let's see what they say to you. What's going on? What are they saying? Mm, anchor out. 
anchoring. It's so, it's like yeah, you gotta take you gotta anchor down. So you gotta put your anchor like you gotta let. It's like you gotta like put yourself in the way and just kind of put yourself there and and stay put. Like you know, like it's like um, it it's like uh, you gotta let your presence known. Like you know, like like uh, put yourself in one spot and and kind of like branch out, but like uh, kind of like let time or let you you know you gotta kind of hold on or stay put that's stay put is what i'm getting anchoring you know whatever anchoring means to you but uh it's like you, you don't don't leave or don't don't be at don't go out of sight you know or put yourself someplace where you're easily found or or um put your roots down you know like I feel like you need to grow a little bit. Hmm. Interesting. No, no more is coming out. Yeah? Oh, it did. Okay. Solitude. Yeah. It's like every experience gives you gives you more. Every experience uh, gives you more. Every everything you do in life will give you more experience. Everything you do in life, you'll learn more. It's like uh, you already learned a lot. It's like you understood quite a few things. Uh, but you also you 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 solitude makes you grow. Yes, it makes you understand things, and that's how you are. That's where you're at. Wow, this does not feel like it's going anywhere, because uh, it's just uh, the wants there, but the action's lacking. I don't know. I, I'm going to leave it like that because uh, see what happens. But um, um, it seems like the person's either too shy or f feel stuck or not confident, and they're just not brave enough to make the the, the initial step. Okay, group five, let's see what's going on. Well, it seems like they, they're battling it out, fighting out, figuring it out, under, trying to understand what's going on. Uh, they're thinking about you. They're, they're thinking that you're a pack of stress or that you're stressful. At the same time, they want you or they, they enjoy you. Um, they, 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 you're their wish. So you stress them out because they want you. That's their thoughts. how they feel well they they've been planning they've been planning um they, they've been they've been knowing they've been pl not so much planning as knowing N knowing um that things are not easy but they gotta they gotta think about it so uh for some reason you're stressing them out and uh they're feeling like they gotta rethink they know that they want you, but they gotta rethink. They know what they want, but they gotta rethink. Yeah, for you, everything is fine. You don't see any problem. Um, you want what you want, and you're gonna try to get what you want. Like that's why you're stressful because you're after them or you're trying to get them their attention or something. And um, yeah, they're not. They, things aren't good. Um, but it will be eventually. They, they, they have some kind of broken heart, or, or they, you know, like um, they have a broken heart, and uh, but things uh, the stress releases them. So to me, that like this is not this is the outcome is not uh, positive because they don't look like they. It looks like uh, they want to break it up with you, and when they do, or they don't, like, they don't want to continue it because when it when it doesn't go anywhere, it, it they have a broken heart, but it, they, they their stress is released at the same time. Let me see what they're saying. Yeah, they're it's it's love. 
or it's feelings, knowing, knowing their feelings. Thought I seen another card. Okay. So um, yeah. I feel like uh, this is not something that's going to go anywhere it's because, uh, I mean, they want you and they know what they want and, and they feel like, like they've been thinking about you and stuff like that. But when they put their feelings into it, they say, no, this is too much. And they, and they talk themselves out of it. And then, and then they say, no, we're not, you're not meant to be. And uh, it releases them stress, even though they're heartbroken. Uh, they feel like this is the best. This is the best way to go about it. And you're you're quite stressed too because you want more. And um, yeah, I'm gonna pull a card from the divine and see what's going on here. Oh, right there, magic. <laughs> Do your magic. Do your magic. Yeah. Says, do your magic. Give, give, give uh, generously. <laughs> you know, give them time. Give them what they need. Give them space. Give them whatever they need, and do your magic and and space it out. So, if you want them, what they're saying, the divine is is your is, the universe is saying, open up. Uh, give them what they need. Be generous with it. And, um, yeah, even if you don't want this, that's what they're saying. Be generous with them. Just open up. Yeah. It's like you, you can, you, you have a different path, a different way. So for me, this is a no go, even though they want to, even though they enjoy you, um, but they know that this won't work out for them and they'd rather have the heartbreak now than later and, and so they, they're not going with it. And for you, it's um, you have a different road anyway to go and you've been forcing it and actually uh, you should be more generous and more uh, letting your magic out there and just expand and uh, just be generous with, with your with uh, your world or who you are or what's around you and just open up and, and, and let that flow and, and give them what they need and and, uh, and go on your way because you have a different path too. I hope this doesn't upset you, but that's what I'm getting, okay? Okay. <laughs>